Karen here from Lillian's Craft El Sol. I'm back today with another little idea with the paint chips that I brought back. Um, I'm going to make a little booklet today. I was inspired by junk journal ideas. However, um, she was actually making journals from them. Mine are quite small. But I'm going to be using um, Line Dot Arrow Natalie's kit, December to Remember. So pop along and take a look at her kit. So I'm just going to quickly put this together. What I'm doing, I've done a um, strip of material, Christmas material, for the spine. I'm putting this on roughly there and there. So what I will do is, is put the glue onto the um, paint chip along the edge here. I'm choosing this one as my front cover. This darker red, as it's going to be for a Christmas journal I'm going to be making. So I'll put that roughly in the middle like that. And then the same on this one. Uh, that way, so it's that side. Down there. I'm trying to get mine standing up so that it comes out a bit quicker. Just about there. You need a bit of a, um, a spine to be able to put your needle through. Oops, like that. So that bends over like that. So you've got this there and there. Okay, I'm going to trim off along here and here. Like that. Then I've already cut some papers, some coffee papers here which um, to size so I'm going to sew them into there like that and I've um, got my embroidery threads here and I've chosen this sort of deeper red to go with the spine as you can see there so I'm using that I keep my embroidery threads in a tea um, caddy we get in the shops tea caddy, I don't know what you call it, a tea box that you put tea bags in. Now this should be pretty straightforward. Um, I will get my little clips. Um, just to hold these in place there. There. So they are going to go in there. I have quite a big needle for this and I'm only going to do two, ho two holes straight through like that. Oops, pull that through there and then back through a bit further up there, I think, like that. Pulled them through like that. And I'm going to tie these off in a bow. Now you could, I did think about tying them off on the other side and putting a bow on the outside. You could do if you wanted to. Um, I just was quite happy with tying it, tying a knot and tying a bow in the middle with this one. And then just trimming off the edges. So it's like that. Then what I've got is, I'm keeping it very simple. I've got a tag and a little pocket that comes with a kit that fits over this hole quite well that I've got in the front of these, of these um, paint chips. So that fits in there. This comes with the kit. It's a little teeny tiny tag. I'm going to ink it in um, Vintage Photo and then stick it over the top on there. I'm using my block or your, whoops, um, oh dear, 
Fabri-Tec um, as my paint chips are quite shiny so I wasn't too sure what they would what if, if tacky glue would hold on them or not so I'm just putting that on there it's a small pocket these are these come this size so they're nice and teeny tiny quite cute really so just ink the tag up and I'm going to be using this along with the um, the other paint chip I made the other day the pocket I'm going to be using this with um, can't get that in there oops yeah we are I should have wait I'll wait for it to dry <laughs> Um, in a journal that I'm making using the December to remember kit as well so that will go in there when that's dry I don't want to force it in there and then on the back I've just got again a little emblem from I don't know what you call it as a little circle from the kit a bit of ephemera I'm just going to put over the gap there at the back again ink it up like that and then I'm just going to put some glue around the edge of it there and that goes that way around so that goes there now at the moment I'm not too sure um, what I'm going to do on the inside I'm thinking I might just leave it because it's quite nice it's a bit different um, and this is just going to go inside the journal that I'm making anyway thanks very much for watching as I say that was a very quick tutorial just using up my paint um, samples that I picked up thanks very much for watching please like and subscribe hit that button and I'll see you again soon bye